excuse me. Hello, my name is Kishwani. That's K E S H W A N I, Kishwani. We are here because we want to improve our math skill. Today is our lesson number 141. Day number 141, and today we'll learn how to convert the speed that is expressed in miles per hour to feet per second. We're being asked to convert 36 miles per hour, speed of 36 miles per hour into feet per second. We are told, that is given to us, we are being given that 5,280 feet, 5,280 feet make one mile. And this is not something we need to memorize in the exam. They will tell us that. They will, tell, they will give us this information that 5,280 feet equals one mile. We don't need to memorize it. Let's get going, shall we? So the speed that is given to us is 36 miles. 36 miles we are going in one hour. Now our job is to have feet on the top and instead of an hour we need to have seconds on the bottom. Feet per second. So let's do it then. So we need the feet on the top, we need to get rid of the miles, so we need to put the miles on the bottom. One mile is made up of 5,280 feet. And 5,280 feet is one mile. In other words, 5,280 feet divided by one mile is just one. We're taking this quantity and multiplying by one, except the one takes this form. Now, so we have the feet on the top, we have a miles on the top here, we have a miles on the bottom, it cancels out. Now let's take care of the hour. We have an hour on the bottom, let's put one hour on the top, and one hour is made up of 60 times 60 seconds. Again, that is also equal to 1. 1 hour divided by 60 times 60 seconds is 1. So we're not changing anything, we're just multiplying this quantity by 1. Now we have hour on the bottom, we have hour on the top, that hour cancels out with that hour, and we're left with seconds on the top, uh, on the bottom, and we have feet per second when we divide this quantity. We have 30, 36 times 5,280, 5,280 times 60 times 60 times 60. On the top we have feet feet per second. Feet per second. That's it. Let's get going then. Let's get going. We see we see this is a multiple of 10. We see this guy is multiple of 10, 5,280. Why don't we divide top and bottom by 10? Let's divide top and bottom by 10. The zero goes away. Let's divide top and bottom by 6. We can cross out this 6 and 36 becomes 6. 60 divided by 6 is 10. So let's divide top and bottom by 6 one more time and 60 becomes 10. That's it. We are done. We're left with five, 528. We are left with 528 divided by 10. 528 divided by 10 is 52.8 feet per second. That's it. It turns out that the speed of 36 miles per hour is 52.8 feet per second. Let's do one more, shall we? Let's do one more, and this time you do it yourself. After I put the speed here, the speed this time, let's do a speed of 60 miles per hour. Convert the speed of 60 miles per hour into feet per second. Do it yourself. I'll give you five seconds for you to be able, for you to, be able to pause and unpause the video. Do it yourself and then we'll compare your work with the work that we will do together in a few seconds time. I'll get out of your way. So we are going at the speed of 50, 60 miles per hour. 60 miles per hour is how many feet per second? Okay, here we go, I'll give you five seconds. Well, nothing is going to change. Wherever we see, wherever 36 appears, the 36 is going to turn into 60. Nothing is going to change. It's the same, same process, this 60 here. So now we have, here we have, let's rewrite this whole thing. Let's see like this whole thing. So here we're going to have 60 times 5,280 feet being divided by 60 times 60 seconds. This is actually very simple. We see 60 on the top, we see 60 at the bottom. Divide top and bottom by 60 is gone. We see 0 here, we see 0 here. Divide top and bottom by 10. Now, five, 528 we have here, 528 divided by 6. This is where I'm going to pause for a second and I'm going to bring your attention to what you see here. 
it says divisibility rules divisibility rules divisibility rules day 25 26 and 27 if you have not watched those three videos make sure you go and watch those videos that's where we learn to recognize if a number is divisible by some other number we learn our divisibility rules make sure you learn those rules what we notice about 528 first of all is that it is an even number that only takes a split second it's an even number which means it's divisible by 2 another thing you should notice right away 528 another thing we should notice is that 528 is made up of 5 2 and 8 5 plus 2 is 7 7 plus 2 is 7 plus 8 is 5 plus 2 is 7 7 plus 8 is 15 15 is divisible by 3 15 is divisible by 3 we just found out that the sum of the digits we just found out that the sum of the digits of 528 is divisible by 3 so here we have a number which is not only an even number which means it's divisible by 2 but also happens to be divisible by 3 if a number is divisible by 2 and it is divisible by 3 then it must be divisible by 6 we learned that on day number 25 this number that we see here is in fact evenly divisible by 6 let's do it let's divide by 6 how many 6 does 5 have 5 has no 6's pay attention okay that 5 is going to go and joins the 2 becomes 52 how many 6 does 52 have 52 has 8 6's 8 6 are 48 8 6 are 48 we use the 48 from 52 we have a remainder of 4 that 4 goes and joins this 8 and becomes 48 one more time and of course 48 is going to have 8 6 is one more time there we go we are done the answer is the answer is 528 divided by 6 is 88 feet per second the answer is 88 feet per second I'll see you tomorrow okay if you have trouble with doing what I just did here look for the videos where I do division quiz there are, there, are, there are videos where we do division a division quiz quizzes there are three or four or five of them I don't know how many there are watch those videos and you will learn how to divide like this okay I'll see you tomorrow okay bye now